So here we are, Abbey Lakes. It was a lovely drive down, nice and smooth. So we arrived the night before, we're gonna camp out. So, the, the guys we're with, the six of us, so choice of swim is gonna be in pairs, but between the pairs, they have a competition who gets choice of swim between the pairs. Best way we can think, lead into a bucket. That's how we're gonna do it. I'm confident. <laughs> I'm not confident. So, but we'll have a go. I'll go first. Let's see how we get on. Let's go. Right, so what? <laughs> so, Mike is number one. Here he goes. First attempt. We've never tried this before. Standing on the bucket. Woo! Miles past. Oh. My go. That was close. Right, so here's Gav. His first attempt. Mine was close. Maybe. Shall Gav get on? Here he goes. Here he goes. Oh, oh, it's oh. Six wraps past it. Mike is attempt number two. Here he goes. Oh, he's tried to stop it into the bucket. You missed. So here we go. There's Gav's second attempt. I think he's going to fly past it. Oh, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone. Oh! <laughs> that was a close one, that was. Oh, no! <laughs> that was online and everything, wasn't yeah. it? Mike's attempt number three. Oh, Miles passed again. Right, this is Gav's third attempt. Let's see if he gets it in. He's gone, he's gone. Oh! Attempt number four for Mikey. Nobody's hit it yet. Oof. Right, let's go again. Here he is. Is he going to get first choice of swim? Oh, a lot of swing on that one. <laughs> Miles short. Miles short. Oh, Gav. You've got to let it go, haven't you? It's, it's weird. <laughs> it doesn't bode well for our casting, does it? This is definitely getting longer than we thought it was going to. We thought this would be easy. Here he goes. That's in. Oh. oh. Do you know if I'd have stopped it, we got oh. it. Well, I can't believe what's just happened. I've just got it in. Genuinely, I've just got it in. Gav didn't press record. <laughs> so I've got a choice of first swim. Not yet. Now Gav has to get this in, has to get this in. Otherwise, I've got a choice of first swim. Oh. <laughs> Don't miss. That's it. First one of the French trip, French trip. It's only a small one, but great start to the week. Off the mark, saves a blank straight away. Relax now and get the rod back out. But yeah, probably say low to mid double. We're off for the mark. Happy days. Fingers crossed for his dad or his granddad or whatever, but we'll see how we go. Sweet. So just stood with Mikey while he was spotting. And this one, left hand rod again, same bait, it's teared off. So, upper double this one, so getting bigger. But we'll get the rod back on the spot, see if we can get one of them uh, French big boys. Really happy though, fish number two, off to a great start. See if we can keep it up. So Mikey gets a few now. Whew, happy days. Right, an eventful start. To the front strip so far, I think we've had six, six between us now. I think. Yeah. I said it's half five this morning. Well, <laughs> it's gone a bit mental. <laughs> so the rod's back on the spot. A few spawns over the top. And we'll see if we can get them back on the munch. My rods are already back out, back on the spots. Crazy. Four rods, all fish on different rods. <laughs> so we've had to literally do four rods again. But Mikey's just putting the old fashioned weight. Likes to have a little spot. And then me, I've boated out. So we've got four fish there, 
biggest at the moment 28 pound we'll get some little videos we'll get some pictures absolutely buzzing first night at abbey lakes for six carp four lit four since half past five this morning kaboom so mad for a couple of hours today first morning abbey lakes there's 28 pounds grace the net we've got three others so we'll get this one back get the others out and we'll show you them bad boys as well what a start absolutely buzzing yellow pop up over a better uh, pellet this was yellow sxb pop up Oz baits yes oh, let's get it back oh. so this is my second one in the morning absolute stunner real nice scale pattern on this one just over 20 pound absolutely more than welcome in my net i'll take these all day long what absolute beauty let's get it back and let's see what gav's got oh come on you abbey lake beauties first one of the quick flurry of bites for me and mikey first one of mine scraper 20 common take that all day long other one in the net's a bit bigger we'll get that out now see if that one plays ball this one's beat me up on the mat so we'll get it back it's an angry one and let's have a look at the other one happy days second fish of the morning for me low 20 about 20 21 something mirror this has got massive shoulders on it it's going to be a big fish this one is one day but cracking fish number four for me number six for us absolutely happy days buzzing and that's 420s now let's get this one back let's get a coffee on i think it's definitely time for a coffee nearly time to pick breakfast up settle down chill out hopefully for the flurry of more fish so an unexpected afternoon bye well, it's not afternoon yet, mate. Well, it's not even now, it's about half 11, isn't it? Yeah, quarter to 12 ish. Sun's up in the sky. This is off the very, very far margin spot. I've seen a couple of fish bosh since I've been here. That 28 pounder come off the same spot. We're into one now. Off the same spot. Again, yellow pop up over pellet. So hopefully, we'll get this one landed. We'll see what we've got. Don't feel too bad. Right, let's give an hand landing this fish and then we'll get some pictures. See you later. So, nice fresh, uh, I'll say fresh, an unexpected day bite. 31 pound, 14 ounces oh, of absolute Abbey Lake wild boar beast. What an absolute belter. Again, yellow pop-up and again over a better pellet not a lot half a kilo maybe not even that half pellet in the boat dropped off at range towards the margin bosh absolutely buzzing with this one so we'll get her back get the rod back out Let's see if we can land some more of these babies 31 14 to get in yes so Sunday now, we're just over 24 hours in. Me and Mikey doubled up, swim eight on wild boar. The rigs I've been catching them on, just to let you know, I have just lost a fish, but it took me straight into the snags. Unfortunately, it happens, but yeah. So just making it now, not finished obviously. I'm fishing an IQ2 rig. So we got bait screw, little D rig, wide gape orc and then i'm currently using the 15 pound fluoro blend from omc um, this is what i've been using on all of this session so far i have got one rod out on a pop-up at the minute which is with the kick i think it's the not the kick but yeah the kickback um omc with dazzler and hook feed 
um, that's also fished on one of the surrender curve hooks from OMC so give it a go we've had fish we've had seven so seven between us up to 31 pound absolute cracker that was out of, the, out of nowhere that bike came but so I'm just gonna finish making this rig I'm gonna get myself ready for tonight in case it kicks off five six rigs ready to go and then see where we go from there but fingers crossed for another light like last night and I'll be really happy so the lights just started to go I've been waiting all day for them to show themselves over there just seen a show in the margin five minutes later a really slow slow bite hit into it and it's just top line right across the lake so hopefully we're into a good one here but we'll see so the light's just fading just done the read, read on the rods been waiting for a show all day seeing the show i said to gav that's got to be minutes away from a bite the bite come really slow bite resulted in a 34 pound six mirror absolute beauty lovely french mirror oh, 34 pound of pure french muscle oh absolutely buzzing they're just getting bigger for me now a 23 a 28 a 31 now 34 oh let's get it back get the rod back on the spot see if we can capitalize on the fish being in that bay yes oh first one of the morning for me only a small common but it's we're off the mark for today so one fish small little common hopefully more to come let's get it back let's carry on been a really quiet probably 24 hours for me and my kit but first thing this morning just off the reed line where I'm fishing I've managed this oh, common so just over mid double but it's a good start to the day fingers crossed for some more let's hope the fish get back down this end because it's been quiet but from a great start so hopefully get back down this end we have a few fish Let's kick start how we started. Come on, come on. Hello, so Tuesday afternoon, just into afternoon, and you'll see new lake. We're on a different lake. So for us on wild boar, it just went completely dead. Um, the swim stopped producing. We had one fish this morning, but in Mikey's side of the swim, never had a show a beep for the last 36 hours so as we do we like catching fish we're going to walk this lake a couple of times and we find a few fish there's a few shows in the middle a few shows down that end um, but a couple of other guys have moved on as well so what we decided to do is double up and swim again go two rods each fish together and uh, see how we go but different world over here it's a clean swim flat calm, sun's blaring, so we're on frog, frog lake we've moved to, peg two, on frog, yeah, so shall we go on this lake, we're com confident on here, we, like I said, like I said we've, we've seen, seen loads of fish, and then since we've been in, in here setting up, we've seen a show over to the left and a show over to the right, so we've seen a show on both sides, which always fills you with confidence, always so fingers crossed we get amongst a few fish my base camp giant jet so we go let's go so I just want to quickly show you the rig that's been catching the fish I know we're on a different new lake now um, but I'm using the same rig as what I had on wild boar I've not changed it, I've not changed the bait. So at the minute, I've got a yellow 
SXB pop-up and just on a Ronnie rig. 12mm pop-up, I've got the yellow Dazzlers from OMC and I've got the Surrender Curve hooks. These have been razor sharp throughout. I've had, I've had four fish, uh, two of which have come out on the same rig, the same hook, and it's, they're still sharp, I've not, I've not changed them at all. So they really are decent. Full of the fish then. So that's what I've been catching on. That I'm not gonna change because pff, it's working. Uh, I know Gav's been doing uh, the approach differently. So I think he's been using white wafters on IQD rigs. I'm sure he'll show you. But that's what I'm using at the minute. Just a simple Ronnie. That's what's been doing my fish. So hopefully I'm gonna get a monk stomp frog. See how we get on. So first bite on frog. Concentrating, but this has come out of nowhere, just coming into first light. Ooh. Oh my god. Hopefully we can get this landed. Show you the first fish from a new lake. Oops. <laughs> Nip one pearl one. Oh, yes. She's in. Woohoo. Get in. First one. Come on, let's have some more. So here it is. Oh. Look at that guys, hey. Woo. 33 pound on the nose. First fish from frog. Absolutely. Oh, buzzing. Buzzing. First 30 of the trip. Get in. Woo. Yes. Let's get a couple of pictures and get a bike. So this is the swim I'm in for the last couple of days. It's Thursday morning and it's the first swim you come to on Frog as you go through the main barrier. Nothing yet. I lost two this morning, uh, hook pulls and gutted. But this is the water you've got from the first peg. I've got one rod down that bait, 19 and a half wraps. One under that tree and I've got one on that far margin. During the night, they are washed in that bay, but to be fair, a lot of the shows are all down the deep end, well, down the, the wider end of the lake. So, this is where we are today. Hopefully, we're in for a couple of fish through the night. A daytime bite's been very, very rare. As you can see, Gav is just spotting in the swim next door so hopefully we will get some fish tonight and have a good couple of last nights here on a uh, frog lake at Abbey Lakes so the dude of a bite time uh, morning bite time here Got one in the net off in that from in that side from side that day not a big one you're all welcome. Absolutely all welcome. So, oh, we had this one this morning. Straight, just under 20 pound. Absolutely all welcome. It's been a hard week, it's been a struggle. But our last day today, the bites haven't come easy at all. 
So every bite for us is precious. Absolutely love every fish that comes on the bank. So get some pictures and we'll get it back. Yes. Hopefully we'll get a few more throughout the day. It's giving out cloudy, pressure's coming down a bit. So see what today brings. Get in. Just getting the rod back out. Just had a lovely fish, it's just in the net soaking. So you don't know when the next bite could be, so as quick as possible, get it back out. Let's try and get another one. So you'll see how I'm set up. He says. Right, let's get the, uh, the 4G off. Deeper connected. When we get over there, I might be there to show you the spot. Hopefully, more to come today. Been doing his fish. And it should come up to about 30 foot in a minute just after the weed bed. to the other margin. Here we go. And there we go. That's it, that's the spot. Oh. See we're doing the bite. A daytime bite on frog. Get in. So it's been very frustrating for me. That's two days, two nights without a bite. I'm watching the water this morning. Pressure's dropped to just under a thousand, well, about a thousand and four. Flat calm, and I've noticed just the odd one fish. It's slowly, slowly, slowly come towards me. I had one show just right to me rod, two rod lengths away, and then this one. Oh. 25 pound on the nose, tore off. And it's 10 o'clock, it's first day bite off frog. Absolutely buzzing. So, let's get a few water shots, just in case. But, what a beauty. It's two fish out of frog for me. Let's hope they come up this end of the lake now, because the guys down the bottom have been catching a few, so. Oh, yes, get in, get in. So just as we're packing away, in the morning, I get a phone call off Gav to say he's got one. What a way to end the morning. Oh, Happy days. Is that a good one? Yes, yeah, it's 30. Apple size scales. Lovely fish to fish. Right. Let's get her out, let's see what she weighs, let's get her back, unfortunately, let's go home. <laughs> <laughs> oh, last morning, and we have this gnarly old warrior, oh, at a scraper 30. Happy days, look at the apple size scales on that. Oh, what a beautiful fish to finish on, proper long as well, but well, unfortunately, Pack up the big one. Gutted. You never like to finish a week's fishing, but it's time to go home. Let's get off the lake. This is the last fish. Very happy. Get in. Oh, so that concludes. Last rod in. Unfortunately, no more fish, but tough week comes to an end. 
now the day journey home. Come on, Marky. Let's get in the van. Let's get out of here. Abbey Lakes, been a pleasure once again. <laughs>